Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we actually have our very last clutch of 2020 that we're going to be pulling. Um, and we're also going to be showing us cutting clutch number 19 and see the results after they shed and all that. So stay tuned. All right, so here she is right here. Um, this is a first time mom. She's actually day 39 from, from, um, from her pre-shed. So she's actually like nine days late. But uh, so far it looks like all the eggs look good from what I could tell. She is a, um, a pewter het pied and she was bred to a banana pied. So half the baby should be visuals, you know, if, if um, the odds are true to what they normally are. Um, we normally play a little game here, um, guessing how many eggs, and I'm going to say there's seven. Jeannie, you say six. six yeah. Camera girl, how many are you saying? Mm -hmm. She shrugs her shoulder. Do you not even throw a number out there? I'm in between both of yours. <laughs> well, I guess six and a half for her. <laughs> All right, let me pull her off. Like I said, she's a first time mom. It looks like a decent clutch, though, for a first time. Let's see if I can... Uh... They just look bigger. They're bigger. Yeah. Uh, there's not not too five, super big. Six. Yeah. Not too bad. So. I'm sure she's all empty. Mrs. Bod was correct. Six. Yep. Um, she's all good and empty. Wasn't yep, this that's me tripping over stuff. Wasn't this me? All right. This one's not viable. No veins. Oh, another one. Oh wait, what was Is that just fluid that I see moving? Yeah. Nothing. All right. So these two eggs here, there's a, uh, there's no veins in them. You can't see it on the camera anyways. Well, we had six eggs, but there's two eggs that have no veins, so those eggs are not going to be any good. I'm going to go ahead and put them in here anyway, and then check them after a few days. But in my experience, they'll start to like sweat really bad and then eventually mold out. So when I notice them starting to sweat, I'll just pull them out. But um, anyways, four good eggs from the last clutch of this season, so that's 20 clutches for us total this year. Hey, welcome back to the channel. It's Jeremy with Bod's Exotic Reptiles. We're going to be cutting clutch number 19, which was a highway female bred to a pastel highway male. And both of them are in this dinner plate. This is the, uh, pa this is the female, which is just a highway. That's a birthmark. It was actually really small as a hatchling. It just got bigger as she got bigger. And then this is the pastel highway. So we are hoping for some super gravels or pastel super gravels. But uh, we'll take whatever we get as long as they're all healthy. <coughs> um, today is day 55. None of them have pipped yet. And you know what? Let me do this so I have a thumbnail. And then we go get going here. Alright. So yeah, nothing's pip, but it's day 55 and you can tell that these guys uh these eggs are definitely ready to cut, so super gravels, highways, and um ivories. ivories are the only things we can get in this. And then also pastel in the mix too as well. That is an ivory. I can't tell if it's a pastel ivory or just an ivory. I don't know. There's is a, that pattern on the side? Yeah, on there's, the back? A, yeah. there's a little right. bit of pattern there. That might be a that might be a pastel highway. It's hard to see. Yeah, yeah, that's pattern. Yeah, that's a highway. Yeah, that's a pastel highway. Okay. 
It's a nice one right out the bat. Sorry, I got Bentley trying to eat a leaf. Oh yeah, we got three dogs in here. <laughs> one right next to camera, camera girl's foot. And he's eating a leaf. <laughs> yeah, I'm crunching it. Kendall, it's your dog. This one is another really light one. Past the highway. That looks like I hit a vein on that. Because it's got pattern on its back. No, that might be a pastel ivory. I'm not sure what a hatchling... This is my first time ever... Oh, you see the pattern? I see the dorsal, which that could be an ivory. If you look at this yeah, one... Ivory will show a dorsal. Yeah, if you see oh, that, true, see true. how dark that one is there? That yeah. Light. And this one's very light, so... But I don't know. It's my first time ever hatching out either ivories, super gravels, or highways, so uh, <laughs> this is all new to me here. And this is actually our last clutch that's in the incubator, um, clutch 19. We have another girl that's actually due to lay any day. Any day. She's actually three days late. Um, ooh, that, that's promising. Uh, that looks like another uh, highway. Highway. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's pastel highway. I don't know. I don't, no, even, I think I don't even know what a hatchling highway. pastel super gravel looks like, to be honest with you. So, my assumption so far is one ivory and two highways. What are you looking up a, <laughs> a, a pastel super gravel? Shh. And also, they probably color up a little bit after they come out and shed, so who knows. Well, that could be... That. Yeah, that's, that one looks a little older there, though. That one is older. There's one. another. I don't know. It's either a pastel... Highway or I don't know. I don't know it's yes, what a yeah. super gravel pastel looks like. That's a, that's a regular super gravel mm -hmm. though. Yeah. Uh, right now I'm just gonna call them highways, and then maybe they'll maybe I can tell well. when they come out. So. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna call those highways for now. Oh, there. That I think is it's gonna. Super gravel. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I don't know. It's definitely different yeah. from these others. Yeah, that would be the super gravel if it is. If... That could be pastel super gravel. Yeah, I don't know. Hopefully, it is a pastel super gravel. That'd be nice. But um. Is it moving? It's gonna. It's gonna take yeah. us a week or so to know. When they come out, well, a couple days probably um, before we find out. Like you guys are gonna find out in about five seconds. All right, so we're back. Um, they all have shed out, and they've all actually had their first meal. And we didn't we didn't hit any super gravels, but I'm pretty happy with the clutch that we got. Um, this here is an ivory, and it's a female. I'm not sure if she's a pastel ivory or an ivory. Um, I want to wait a couple more meals and see if she colors up and just kind of look online. I haven't even looked online to see what a pastel ivory looks like compared to a regular ivory. But um, she's already spoken for. I'm actually going to keep this girl back. But um, yeah, so that's that's the only ivory that we got. Then this, this is a male. Obviously he's a highway. And that is the only normal highway that we got. And this guy will be available um, after, of course, he's had five consecutive meals. He's only on his first meal right now. And now we get into the really cool looking animals. 
Now, I say we don't have any super gravels, and I say that because I had a couple people look at these, and um, they're so close on some of the some of the, anim the super gravels that you see on Morph Market. Like uh, the this here, I'm calling it a pastel highway. A lot of the super gravels where the dorsal striping is, it's kind of sideways instead of, you know, in a straight line. But then I've seen some where they're in a straight line, but me not knowing 100%, if they are super gravels, I'm going to be selling them as pastel highways and somebody gets a bonus. I mean, I would rather undersell than oversell. Or am I saying that right? It was it be oversell than undersell? No. If I'm giving them under than over. Giving them more than That's what they're paying. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, all right. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna call this guy, and it's a male, and this guy is available, but uh, he's a pastel highway, as far as I know. Okay, the ne these next two are girls, and actually, both of these are spoken for. I'm actually going to keep one of them, and then uh, another customer of mine seen the pictures, I believe, on Instagram, and um, she's she's taken the other one. Um, again, I think they're. I'm pretty sure that they're going to be pastel highways. I don't think they're super gravels. I'm going to try this pairing again next year, and hopefully, I get lucky with the super gravel or a pastel super gravel. But uh. I, I'm pretty happy with the outcome. I mean, I could have got just a bunch of ivories, you know, normal ivories, but I only got one ivory and everything else ended up being highways and I was able to get two holdbacks out of it. So yeah, I'm more than happy. And that is clutch 19. And we have one more clutch that um, I think they're due to like towards the end of December to hatch. So. That would be 20 clutches that we had this year. I, I expected around 24, 25, but, you know, 20 happened, so I'm good with that. Next season, I think I'm guessing maybe 35, give or take, you know, because I have a lot of females. A lot of first-time females that are going to be up to size. So I'm saying 35. It might be 28, 29. Who knows? We'll see. But uh, thanks again for watching, and we will have clutch 20 video it'll be probably close to the new year i guess you know by the time they come out and shed be after the new year actually so uh stay tuned and thank you